à tous de l'EDO. Attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, unité, top. Allumage moteur vulcan. Allumage UAP et top décollage. Les paramètres bons sont conformes à l'attendu. local time and right on time you saw it Ariane 5 began her mission roaring off from the ground here in French Guiana with a lot of fire going up through the thin cloud layer we had so much rain today we didn't think we'd have any visibility at all but look at her go she's carrying two satellites two new telecom satellites the two boosters providing 90 that's 90 percent of our thrust right now propelling the launcher along her trajectory at an ever higher velocity 775 tons at liftoff and to get that sort of mass off the ground you need a lot of push and you can see push we have she's burning five tons of fuel every second that's two and a half tons of fuel every second in each booster and the core stage burning another 300 kilos of fuel per second into the blue sky she goes beginning her fifth mission of the year Ariane 5 now following the program in the onboard computer which gives all the orders including stage separations which we'll soon begin to see in about 20 seconds we're in the first of four flight phases and we'll describe each in turn and in detail you can follow Ariane as she heads east across the Atlantic the first three phases are powered like this one and the fourth is not Right now, the first flight phase, the single first stage engine and the two boosters are burning. Another about uh, 12 seconds for them. And they will be the first to be extinguished. And you'll hear that from the DDO, but also with the camera work we have, you'll see the flame out there. Should be right about now. That looks like the flame out right there. You are. The two boosters falling away on either side you see that very clearly and the dot in the middle that is the core stage area and continuing on her way very clear shots haven't seen this in quite a while the first flight phase using both cryogenic and storable propellant cryogenic in the main stage the, the dot that's still burning and storable propellant in the boosters who have done their job their uh, pros and cons to each cryogenic propulsion offers certain advantages as uh, getting us off uh, the ground and it is more precise the DDO has confirmed of course separation of the two boosters the boosters will fall away uh, about 500 uh, kilometers from shore into a protected area next up fairing separation and with this visibility, you'll probably be able to see that as well. And you can see that perfectly clear. The two light blue dots, those are the two halves of the fairing falling away from the mothership. We haven't seen clear skies like this in at least a year. So this is a wonderful, wonderful sight. Arian, the main dot in the middle, the dot of light, is the first stage continuing again on her mission. The two points of light falling away, those are the halves of the fairing. We don't even need the onboard camera that we have because this is much better. Fairing separation coming at 112 kilometers up roughly because we're out of the Earth's atmosphere. <laughs> 